What's going on YouTube? We're back today, Man 16 Ultimate Team, with a gameplay video today. It's a little bit different. I haven't done a gameplay video in a long time. I uh, don't think we've made any changes since the last update, but since the last game, I think Devontae Freeman and Woodson, this is their first game, and Shaq Thompson. But uh, we are 6-0, trying to go 7-0 in this game. Two wins away from a first round bye. Von Miller gets an opening sack on the very first play. You gotta love that. Third and 18. Uh, this game was very laggy, as you see right there. Our defense goes dumb. Who, I think that was Chung. That's one reason why I want a new, uh, why I want that Chun, new 99 Chun Taylor. Because his zone coverage is a lot better than Chung. And Chung is... He's good at run stuff, but once it comes to passing situations, no, he's he's not good, not good at all. But uh, so he scores seven nothing, nothing you can really do about that score. Defense just went down. I didn't play underneath. I just called cover four, back the coverage off, and uh, it went down. Right here, first pass of the game, we give it to Demarius Thomas. With the lag, and uh, he didn't uh, go up. We tied the game 7-7. Seven to seven. Uh, He runs there on 3rd and 3. Kind of should have played a 4-3 there instead of going quarters. 1st uh, and 10 here. He loves just throwing the ball up. He loves throwing the ball up. Right there. Just going deep. Trying. Uh, thankfully, Woodson got the pick. So we get the ball. Now, uh, what I want to do is kill clock. Don't let him see the ball for the rest of the game. And uh, go out there and win this game. That's what I want. And on third and one, oh man, about to sneeze. We get the first down. I don't know why we did that, but whatever. Second and six, we go to the toss again. I ran the ball on him. He kept on calling like man blitzes, so I was like, all right, I'm just going to run. And I got seven plus yards a carry against this guy. Pretty easy. At least on most runs, I would get seven plus yards. And he wouldn't change his defense. He would keep on calling the same play, same play, same play. So I kept on calling the same play because it worked. Why change something when it uh, doesn't, when it's working? You don't stick with it. So uh, we're up 10 to 7. We end up selling for a field goal there right before halftime. Now we're just killing clock. I want to score a touchdown here, kill as much clock as I can, hit two clock, and uh, keep the ball away from this guy as long as possible. Because I know my defense does stupid stuff, and aggressive catching is just ridiculous this year. So we score a touchdown there and go up by 10. Fortunately, we gave him a lot of time. That's the bad part. But with this, all you need is like 20 seconds. If you have, there's 20 seconds left on the clock, and you have three timeouts, guess what? You can score a touchdown on probably about three plays. Because of this. This is the reason why you can do that. He just goes deep, throws the ball up. My guy's in position, and that's aggressive catching Madden. 16. Right there. That's Madden 16. So, we still have the lead, though. And that's key. So we just could keep on giving the ball to Devontae. He's not going to change his defense up. I'm not going to change my offense up. I'm going to run away from you, and I'm going to kill clock. So we're already almost to the two-minute warning here. Second and five. Get a toss play here. Get to the outside. We get the first down. That's important. We do step out of bounds, which kills, stops the clock. But uh, right here, we end up picking up a couple more first downs. He doesn't use any of his timeouts, as you see, he still has three timeouts here. So we're just going to keep running the ball, and on third down, uh, right here, he uses the timeout, which, okay. So third and 17, so I'm like, okay, we do a toss play, just run around for five seconds, the game's over. And that's exactly what we did. We get put in Archer, just run around right there, five seconds, and game over. So we end up winning this game 17-14 with the lag. Uh, the aggressive catching, which there's nothing you can do about that. Bad defense, right defense, uh, safety's side. doing dumb stuff. Close, Can't do anything about that. You Just Madden stuff. It's Madden 16 go. stuff. That's how he scored. Madden 16 stuff. As you see, we went for 204 rushing yards, 40 passing yards, uh, got a pick, got a rushing touchdown, a passing touchdown, field goal, we got sack. And uh, we moved to 7 0, and our one went away from a first round bye. Uh, I don't know when the next Madden video is going to be. Madden is just so crazy right now. So crazy. They're bringing out the stupid ass packs. Aggressive catching is ridiculous. Even though you have a 97 overall wide receiver who plays the ball aggressive in the air, he still goes dumb. 
So there's nothing you can do about aggressive catching. There's not. There's nothing. There's not anything you can possibly do. Other than probably play two man under and double team them. Other than that, aggressive catching one on one situations, it's going to go to the receiver about 80% of the time. About 80% of the time, the receiver is going to win that battle. If you throw it up eight times, out of ten, uh, you throw it up ten times, the receiver's probably going to win eight of those. Maybe seven. At least seven. So that's just ridiculous. It's not It's not uh, football. But uh, that's going to be the end of this episode, guys. We get the victory. We're 7-0 on the season. And uh, that's it. Like, subscribe, comment, share. I'm out. So next time, as always, do work.